So this is an F-14 Tomcat. What you saw Tom Cruise fly in the original Top Gun. Top Gun's coming out again. Um, they're gonna change up the airplane. I think it's gonna be an F-18 F or something. I don't even know. But an F-14 Tomcat is what they used in the original Tom, Top Gear. And that's what I built today in less than five minutes of time and 221 pieces. So let's go take a look and see how I built this really cool military F-14 Tomcat. Let's go check it out. So this is Aviation Week and this is probably the hardest build that we've ever done. We only have five minutes. I think I'm gonna go over. I'm gonna just let you know that right now. We are going to try to build an F-14 Tomcat fighter jet, okay? That's got a lot of different features in it. I'm not exactly sure how we're going to integrate that into the amount of pieces that we have here, but I'm only gonna stay to these pieces, but I'm probably gonna go over time. So let's get started. Let's put five minutes on the clock. We're gonna to try to build a F-14 Tomcat. Um, so I grew up in the 90s and late 80s, and Top Gun was a huge, huge hit. And uh, I used to watch that all the time on weekends when it finally went over to TV. And the Tomcat was the main, main plane there, I believe, um, or a version of that F-14, F-15 kind of look to it. And it, those planes are amazing. So we're gonna do something where we kind of give a, uh, a nod to it and hopefully uh, build up an F-14 Tomcat in a way that looks really cool. So let's try that there and there. And then it's got its wings out back like that. And then it's got wings. It's got wings that start as delta wings and then go down, right? Or go back. Or it starts as a delta wing and then go out more. So that's pretty cool. Um, I'm gonna do that. So something around that shape. Let's go up here. And then it has a pretty cool nose to it as well. And the cab is all the way up at the front. Well, not all the way up at the front. It is a bigger cab. It's normally a two people, I believe, or at least these can hold two it never and I don't think it could hold three but that's, that's just the way it is then I like to integrate these into the engines into the back here right I mean that would really be cool but we'll see if I can figure that out Again, I think I'm going to go over. I'm already two minutes in. I have an overall general layout that I'm trying to abide by though already, so that's not bad. Okay, so I need blue. Okay, that looks like the back of an F-14 jet fighter. Okay, so definitely need to figure out how to integrate that. Next. And then I'm going to use these up here for some sort of uh, kind of look to it. Yeah, because it, it has these like hunches, you know, on the back side of the, of the, of the jet that, where the engines basically start. Okay, so maybe... Okay. Same over there. And the wings. Oh uh, yeah. Okay. So I gotta integrate the wings somehow into that. So 
then what I need is some sort of like brown piece over there. There we go. So now I actually can start all the way in the back with my, my Ford. That. Okay. Not bad. Not too bad. And then use the purple. Well, I need something in the middle here. Where are the tan pieces? So this is where the intake of the engines are, right there on that slope. Actually, I'm gonna drop that down a little more. Just drop it down one. Yeah, looks better already. Okay, drop it down one. And there we go. This is gonna get a piece there. Wow, that's starting to really shape up. It's five minutes or up. Okay, I got it. If we stop there, I'm pretty happy. That definitely looks to me like a F-14 Tomcat with the wings 100% out. That looks pretty close. Oh, come on now. Come on now. Come on now. That looks amazing. Would it be better if I take these off? I'm going to go through some tweaking. Maybe it looks better if we do that. Yep, it does. That looks better. It still gives that roundedness to the back end uh, that the F4, F14 had. The engines, the back end, that looks like an F-14 back end. Where the engines are coming out. So I'm looking at the picture. The only thing I would probably add is like a little, a little piece, a little tail over here. That'd probably be the only piece that I would add, but I'm not exactly sure I would, how I would add it. But the, the completely horizontal wings looks pretty good and uh definitely this part here that this part here is definitely something that i think uh really adds that that flavor that it is an f14 so i really liking that quite a bit i think it looks really good i think it looks really close to an f14 um i'm really liking it so thumbs up from me, or at least from me, to me. If you think this was a good build, leave a comment down below. If you think you could have done better, or if there was a technique that I should have been using, leave a comment down below. Love to hear about it. Maybe I can integrate in that into the next build. Okay, that was the final of Aviation Week. We're going to start trickling into um, Thanksgiving Week. So leave a comment down below as to what you think we should be building for thanksgiving thanks everybody for watching we'll see you next time bye bye so there you go there's a jet over our heads right now it's just flying by this is november this is aviation month and we are going to spin the wheel of makers and find out what we're going to build tomorrow that yesterday's build which was the tomcat was fantastic now let's see what we're going to build tomorrow so it's a bonus, whatever I want to build. So that's really cool. So let's go tune in tomorrow to see what I'm going to make in the next five minute build. Also, remember to subscribe and hit the bell down below so you get notifications of when our daily videos come out to you. Thanks everybody for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.